Back at it, back at it. 400th stream as well, I know. Shocking, isn't it? 400, number 400. <laughs> Crazy to think. Crazy to think. Well, here we are, back at it again. Monday, Wednesday, live streams after the long vacation and then a work trip. Glad to be back in the seat, everybody. It's fantastic. Fantastic. Who's in the chat? We have Fat Seagull, Dirt Ripper. Hopefully, Parker the Pug, Jackson, CJ's in the house. Jackson again, Legendary Fishing's here. Right on, man. YouTube Wolf, the YouTube Wolf plays. Uh, Hayden, we got Kilo Knight, Paul, Gene, Parker, really, Paul, already? <laughs> hey, well, good deal. Wisconsin Average is here as well. Top notch. Well, everyone, we uh, we are headed back to Weeping Willows to see if we can manage the 100 pound carp again. Uh, we got our spod rod. We got our three rods. Um, hopefully that, I don't know. You can obviously go to the fourth rod, but I always worry juggling four rods. Like I'm afraid I'm gonna lose one of them. And that's just like a potential 100 pounder swimming away at that point. So we're gonna go ahead with three rods and hopefully we can manage it. Let's travel to Weeping Willows. I think I have enough gear, like equipment and like uh, bait and whatnot to hold us for like three days. So hopefully that should be enough for the live stream. But if not, we can always go get some more. But let's join into a friend server here. Bo was good, was good. Um, you know, just lots of stuff, man. Got a lot of stuff going on. Our company's got a big contract going on right now, so I'm doing a lot of stuff at work. And then uh, the big trip to Taiwan went well. I have like three videos that I need to uh, put together for that. So I've been writing scripts for that sort of stuff. But uh, other than that, man, business as usual. Business as usual, other than that. 
We gotta look for the sunny day. How, how long do we have to go to get to a sunny day? Oh my god. The day six? We have to go to day six. Evidently. Wait. Did I just completely skip over this? Hey, day three. Okay, day three is all we gotta do. Top notch. We're going to this. And then... Lots of spotting. We got the uh, the new Gigantica mix. Uh, we're gonna get the oil cake pea in there. Six ounces of oil cake pea. Very important. Mix that together and throw it into the spot and get it out there. All uh, what was it? Like everything basically? Throughout the entirety of it or something? Or was it just ten? I can't remember. I can't remember now. It's been too long. First time catching the stream. I've enjoyed some of your past videos. Well, thank you. Just some of them. That's good to hear. I always, I always wonder about those people who say they enjoy all of them. You know, it's good to see that there are people who just enjoy some of them. That's good. Top notch. Let's start throwing this out there. Get those big carp in. Evidently. It matters quite a bit to make sure that you have a lot of bait out there to bring in the big fish. So uh, that's what we're going to do. We're going to spend a lot of time getting to know one another while we spot out a bazillion of these spots. Um, so let's let's do it. That's number two. I always lose count, so count with me. Thought you were playing Call of the Wild of the Angler. Oh, really? You thought I was. Does this look like Call of the Wild, the angler? With the, the spod rod and the uh, the pod for all my rods and whatnot. Similar similar type of game. I haven't played it in a while, but I know a new map came out. It came out right as like my vacation was going on. So uh, I haven't had a chance to look at it, but I am uh, looking forward to getting to it at some point. <laughs> what happened to the beard? I, I, shaved, I shaved it off. Taiwan was uh, was a rather warm place. It was rather tropical, and uh, and was no uh, no place for a long beard. But um, unfortunately, I had quite a quite a you know a, a, a rough looking face. The majority of the trip, it was hot. It was a hot one. The man, the myth, the legend is back. Right on. I agree. We are back. We're kicking. You're going to have to, uh, you know, just roll with it. I've been up since 4.30, so I'm trying to keep my energy high, but I can't guarantee it. <laughs> well, well, we'll just keep trying. See, I've already lost track of how many we've thrown out. That number seven. New landing net feature makes it so difficult to successfully juggle rods. It just takes so long to land a fish. You think so? I, I I honestly just look at it either way, uh, whether you're using the landing net or not. I enjoy the landing net; it makes it more fun uh, to me anyway. But uh, but I just find it hard to juggle three three or more giant fish at the same time. You're bound to lose one of them, at least. So hold off, you know. Five or seven speckled trout fishing with a popping cork and voodoo. 3.25 shrimp in real life. We're right on. That's awesome. Just first catching. I've enjoyed some of your best videos. Yes, I read that one a while ago. Howdy, 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 JT. How's it going? Fishing down under the low is blue with a light blue shark. Down under the blue. What? What are you talking about? What you talking about? Finally got the Halloween kayak. Took about two years of collecting pumpkins to get it for free. Surprisingly, got the rod too. I didn't think I had time for that. Well, right on, man. That's awesome. Yeah, we completely missed the Halloween, didn't we? Well, I completely screwed that cast up. Let's try that again. What are you trying to catch? We are bass fishing today. Uh, bass fishing or if, if possible, sailfish would be cool we'll just have to see what's biting i suppose we're out here at weeping willows it is known for its uh flounder fishing but we are attempting bass and sailfish today 
just drink five monsters. I, you know, I don't have enough uh, monsters. And even if I did, I, I would have to blend them up. Uh, you know, if they're hairy monsters, then, you know, you have to deal with all that hair and shaving them. It's just, it's, uh, it's begins to be too much work to be quite honest. But it is what it is. The landing net is so bad. Really? That's interesting to hear. To each their own, I suppose. I really enjoy the landing net. I, I think it, I think it's a fun... Makes the game feel more realistic. When I catch bigger fish in real life, like, I'm using a net to land them. So, to not do that in a game feels weird. Like, it just doesn't feel as realistic as, you know, fishing in real life. You don't just whip a 50 pounder up onto your hand and like grab him. Like that's not, that's not something you do. <clears throat> when do you need to get the landing net? I'm not really sure when the landing net starts. Is it, uh, is it like over 15 pounds or something like that? Not quite sure. I have none of these high tech poles. We had to catch them with our hands. Catch them with our hands. I'm like just throwing out all of it. At this point, we might as well. We only have a little bit left. We're going for the biggins. You can't tell us not to. No one's here to tell us anything. We can do what we want. How you doing? How am I doing? I'm doing quite well. Thanks for asking. Oh my god, just go away. Alright, one more throw. I think. Just about anyway. And it was a bad one. Sweet. How am I doing? Doing quite well. Thanks for asking, Southern Kid. Give me your best howdy. Howdy howdy. I don't I don't how much more to it, I suppose. Was something big for us for the next game? Oh my gosh, yes. So excited about that. We have a fantastic game. We're gonna play it all the way through. It's gonna be like the first time in Gaming Month history that we're actually going to like start from the beginning of a game and like finish the entire game with episodes. I can't, I don't know if we've done that yet, but uh, we are gonna do that this year. So I'm really excited about it. Plum, is that what we're using? Plum? Evidently. We're using plum. I'm partial to um, to orange was my was my favorite. Citrus. I'm gonna try citrus. We'll throw plum on one of them, just for the heck of it. We'll go citrus, plum, and uh, and strawberry. How about how about that? That's how old I am to uh, remember the cash me outside girl. Remember that? The cash me outside. All right. Carpington. We're looking for the hundred pounder. Where are ya? This is where we're gonna get it. You just caught your carp glasses and it is the fourth in the world. Hey, that's awesome. Hey, yo, hey, oh, welcome back, Sadie Snail. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. On your hand early and your hand still smells funky. Ooh, that'll do it, man. That will do it, that's for sure. <laughs> that's such an awful thing to spill on you, too. Yaw. Can't progress any further in this game, and it's also hard for me to make money. Any tips? Man, I don't know. It's hard to say. If you followed along with the beginner series, then uh, then there's not much more I can tell you. He's back. He's back. Guess who's back? Back again. Hopefully a hundred pound carp. And we'll tell a friend. Okay, so it is a mirror. We're starting off with a mirror. Doesn't necessarily look like a hundred pounder. But I'm willing to hope. I'm willing to hope. He does look like a pretty sizable fish, though. 
Come here, get in the net, you. Get in the net. Are we gonna see some unicorns at least? Start us off? We are! 79 pounder! Starting us off with some unicorns. Righto, righto. Well, not the 100 pounder, but just near 80 pounds anyway. I wouldn't be mad about that. I wouldn't be mad about an 80 pounder car from real life. Pretty sweet. Just near 80 pounds anyway. We'll keep that guy. Throw it out here. We still got four, four or five more carp to catch out here. So let's keep it going. Hello, now you bought. Catch him, bull. So you just got back from Taiwan. What type of fish were you able to catch there? The, uh, the big fish to catch in Taiwan, other than the fact that it's an island nation. So they got all of the ocean fish around it, including, you know, all those fish that we're going to be uh, catching in the new fishing planet map coming out late 2023 early 2024 um they got all those fish they can catch but the big one in land um was the this looks like a small boy was the fabled giant snakehead you might have seen it in an episode of river monsters the giant snakehead Did we just crash What's going on? Just ran that that eleven point seven one pound common carp just randomly crashed the game. Evidently, got a thirteen pointer this weekend, but you have got no now bigger, no bigger. I the one behind is is a twelve pointer, so you you've got me beat. You've got me. What a start. What a start. Oh, it's slowly coming back. We got a loading wheel now. What's going on? Because Weaving Wells is objectively the best place to go until Amazonian Maze. You think so? I'm that's why I'm looking forward to seeing anyway. Dude, it's you. Were you in Kansas recently? People have said. You know, I have heard some things, some paparazzi sort of things that uh, that I might have been seen in the area. But, uh, but you know, I tried to keep the cameras away. Tried to keep it pretty low key. Kept kept the visits to just close friends and family, you know, that sort of thing. So, uh, you know, I did my best to stay out of the public eye, you know? <laughs> What's up? What's up? I think, I think, guys, I think we might have to close. I hope that all the spot and stuff stays there, but I have a feeling it won't. Gosh dang it. Gosh dang it. All right, you know what, you know what it is. I don't do the whole three strikes thing when it comes to crashes. Crash me once, shame on you. Crash me twice, shame on me. So we're going to give it one more chance. If we end up crashing again, we're going to have to switch to something else. Giant Snakehead, a.k.a. the Toman. Very true. Very true. I got lots of stuff. I might even give you a sneak peek. I got a, I got an idea of a video I could show you. Something something small, but to give you a little bit of a, little bit of a sneak peeker of something going on. Let's see if I can arrange it while we're waiting for this to load. While we're waiting for this to load, let's see if I can get something. Oh god, I don't know why it keeps doing this. Might be really annoying to listen to with the audio, but I might turn it down. Connection to the server is lost. That's not good. All right, let's turn on screen two here. I'll show you what we're dealing with. Turn off the music for just a moment here. Toman. Ah. <laughs> 
So this was actually like the the last day that we were leaving. <laughs> this restaurant had these in an aquarium, and I wish I would have known that because ha had we stayed one more day, I would have uh, I would have asked him to uh, cook one up for me that I could see what they tasted like. <laughs> <laughs> but uh but each one of those tomen in that tank were each like 26 inches long like they were i mean they were each like this big they probably each weighed like eight pounds or so like that so it's just so funny that the adult tamen or uh tomen are so so the big you know they're just like they're just a fun fish dude anyway let's see what we're looking like in fishing planet now get the music back up and going all right, we're good to go. We got our stuff again. I have a feeling we're gonna have to respawn, which is really annoying. We might throw our rods out just, just in case. Just in case. Is it a global server glitch? I don't know. Your game clashed, okay, so maybe it was. Maybe it was just a, a thing overall. Uh, we might throw this out real quick just to see if we get anything. We'll, we'll let them sit there for uh, for a few for a minute or two, but I doubt it. I doubt. I think it all probably got erased, which is annoying. Just erase like 15 spots or more, just like that. They were overfished on a wrong way. On a wrong way. What do you mean by that? Are you going to make more of the river monster? I mean, that would be great. Absolutely. Haven't done an official test, but from 68 to 75 unique eel farming seems to be better than anything else. You then skip next night, 11,000 XP, 10 to 15 minutes. Interesting. Would be interesting to see. Of course, a couple live streams ago, we caught the uh, unique Arapaima pretty quickly, honestly. I think it was the first fish we caught. We, like, drove our boat out there, set out a line for a unique Arapaima, caught it on the first thing, and it was, like, 26,000 XP. And then we could have switched the night if we wanted to. Um, so if you you could potentially set out a line for the... For the... Uh, for the uh, electric eel and set out a line for a unique arapaima catch potentially like 37,000 xp in one night and then move on <laughs> if you could manage it surprising you can't catch snakeheads and fish but i know kenther is that how you pronounce that kenther all right guys i don't think it's gonna work no did it just crash again are you serious right now? You surprised? I'm surprised by the crashing of fishing planet. Yeah. All right. All right. Fool me once. Fool me twice. All right. Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and play something else, I guess. I just totally threw off my entire plan. Huh. Interessante. Interessante. Let me... Boop, 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 boop. Um... I got a code. I think. Oh no, that's the Epic Game Store. Well, shucks. 
Shuck's a duck. Hmm. Oh, here we go. Got it. We got it. I got it. Got to activate this real quick. Now we just need to, uh, now we just need to wait for this darn thing to, uh, to download. What else can I show you? Let's see here. I don't want to give away too much because I don't want to give away like, uh, fun, fun stuff and all that sort of, st you know, stuff in there. Let's see what I can show you. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Overcast condition is quite right now. Uh-huh. Um, 20977. Give me a second, give me a second. Pay attention, pay attention. Ooh. Good job, keep going, keep going. Ooh. Oh, it seems to be working fine for other people, eh? He's gonna try and go under for the sure. Of that, yeah. Ooh, there he goes. <laughs> Nice. Dude, that's a good one. Oh, good fish, good fish. Okay, don't, don't reel anymore. Bow, bow. <laughs> get, get on the way. <laughs> nice. Let's go. Yes. yes! Oh, oh, sneak peeks, sneak peeks. You think we should try it a third time? I'm waiting, I'm waiting for this other game to install. It just finished installing. All right, I'll give it one more try. Shame on me. Now, now, if it, if it quits a third time, then it's just shame on everything. <laughs> <laughs> it happens a third time. We're not friends anymore. <laughs> it's not crashing for you. Oh man. Do you have to be overly concerned on where you spend your points? I don't want to regret it later. Um, I don't know. Uh, so Socrates, I, I think I have points right now that I haven't spent just because I'm kind of waiting to see the stuff that I'm unlocking and the stuff that uh, will will work on the lakes that I'm going to because sometimes you go to a new lake and you find out that one method for fish works well in Russian fishing for but you have to unlock that method via skill points 
And that's where like having some skill points can come in handy to like actually like work towards that because you may be fishing, um, oh God, what's it called? Mosquito Lake or something like that and thinking, okay, I want to get into bottom fishing. I'm going to put more points in the bottom fishing. Next thing you know, you're at the river trying to, you know, fish for trout or something like that. And you're like, why did I put so many points in the bottom fishing? I should have put them into, you know, spinning or something like that. And it's just, it's, it can just, just real quick, but you can hope by that point you have more points to, uh, to do stuff with. So who knows, man, I'm always a little hesitant just, just in case. But you never know. You never know. Okay, let's just go ahead. Hope for the best here. I'm going to go ahead and do... Really? What the recipe is? Good okie, if that's what it says. video idea on the server about rigs and offset what would be the difference between a normal setup and the benefits i'm not really sure to be quite honest i don't know what the benefits of using like an offset rig is and compared to a jig head for instance oh i think we can delete that one there we go all right, let's get to spotting. Everyone's favorite part of carp fishing, spotting. Everybody loves to spot. I, uh, I've thought about selling t-shirts in the past. I love to spot sort of thing. Are you late? No, you're fine. Oh, I doubt that. I was in a game and everyone left me, but I was confused. Ooh. You were confused. Have I played the new Fortnite season? I've never played a season of Fortnite in my life. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, thank God. It's, it's acting rather fishy in a bad way. It's not acting the right kind of fishy in Fishing Planet. Money spending addiction and fishing plan level 10 was the best way to make money. Uh, if you're level 10, I think you should be able to go to Emerald Lake. I think anyway, otherwise you're going to be fishing for like bass and mud water for quite a while to make some money. But the biggest tip is obviously to, uh, to watch the BZO beginner series, the free to play beginner series, to give you a good, good pathway to making your way up through the game. Maybe there's too many players like that. I surely hope not. I mean, it would be great. Great for Fishing Planet, if that were the case. Oh, is that right? You all may not know this, but we're all joined by King Bjorn right now. I wish I could just take the camera and point it down so that you could see. But uh, he is sleeping. He's snoozing beside us. So if you hear a loud exhale, and it didn't come from me, realize that it's... Uh, it's this snooze, snooze lord down here. Call the wild the angler if it quits again. That's uh, that's what was updating in the background, man. YouTube Wolf Plays is here. Man, I am just ruining my spods. My spods. I'm going to clip the line here if it keeps doing that. It's, it's, it's going up too fast. Is Russian fishing good? It is pretty good. Yeah, it's a good, good little game. Come on, go, go. For gaming month, see how many people ask, when will you be playing Fishing Planet? Hey, can you do more Fishing Planet? I think, um, I think I might just run. Like, I'll, I'll start running ads, um, throughout the next two months, telling people about, uh, gaming month. You know. And then when gaming month comes along, I think in the beginning of the videos, I'll do another ad basically saying, Hey, do you know it's gaming month? 
That means we're not playing Fishing Planet, so don't ask. <laughs> and then we'll get into the video. I think that'll be a good way to start every video. Just be kind of just like me just going, Hey, you, don't ask about Fishing Planet. <laughs> it's going to suck really bad if Fishing Planet then puts out the ocean update during gaming month. Because that will just ruin everything. <laughs> You got 2.4 million? Well, now you're talking about my money in Fishing Planet and all my subscribers, so yeah, I guess so. When are you going to cover Coral Island? Coral Island? Why does that sound familiar and yet I don't know what it is? Weather has been horrible in the UK. Oh my god. Oh my god. Why has it been horrible? You always do better with regular lures. Lag, lag, lag. I hope not. I think we're doing okay. I'm throwing it all out. They can't stop me. This is how we're gonna get the big one. He's back, Fishing Kid says. Bit lag, but it's okay now. Well, that's good. Maybe there's just bad internet all around the world right now. Around the world, around the world, around the world. Offset hooks are only good for the Congo Nile perch. They, uh, they certainly seem to like the uh, big old soft plastics, don't they? Watch them all, but if I edit the vids, it doesn't show the full time you sitting there. I I guess not. I'm not really sure. I would need a specific thing. The best way to go about it is to just look at like the top left where it says the day and the time. You can kind of get a get a rough estimate of how long I've been there. I'm so confused what's going on right now. Reload the spot, please. This looks like we're playing the claw game right now. Yeah, frick that shit, bruh. All right, we're done. We gave it a try two times. We're gonna have to move on to another game, unfortunately. Boy, this, this return live stream is freaking crazy awesome, man. Did you go to that BZ Hub live stream his first day back for like three weeks? Bro, sick as frick, man. It was awesome. His game kept crashing like a bad driver. Big storm from the hot and cold air from the USA. Oh, from the U. Oh, so it's our fault, huh? You're getting an, an American storm. Did the storm come through and just it just it was just chanting USA USA All right, we're Audi Audi 500 baby Gonna play a different game uh, mm, I tell you what I would play call of the wild the angler except that I think we might spend all of Wednesday playing that So let's go play some go play people's second favorite <laughs> or or first favorite realistic fishing game. <laughs> I'll uh, I'll hopefully I doubt it, but I'll hopefully get uh, more prepared for because I haven't even been to the Spain map yet in uh, in Call of the Wild the Angler. So Parker the Pugs, bye-bye. Bye-bye, Parker the Pug. Just got here, so does that mean I shouldn't watch the rest of the stream? You do what you want. You're your own person. You're going to ask me whether you you should stay here the whole time? Uh, be in charge of your life. Do what you want to do. Golly. Don't let me change. Just because I put out a bunch of videos about Fishing Planet doesn't mean you have to listen to a lick of it. 
you can decide to do your own thing. And then when it goes wrong, then you can decide, you know what, my own thing kind of suck. I'm going to go listen to this other guy. <laughs> Be yourself. It's what Bo Burnham says. Be yourself. Unless who you are sucks, then be someone else. Be anyone else. Just don't be yourself. Because sometimes if you're being yourself, that person who is you could be annoying to some other people. So then be someone else. Those are wide, wise words, you know. Wise words from a wise man. Yep, you're going to have to catch the 100-pound carp all by yourself, man. All right, let's catch some tench, bro. I don't even know what we're throwing here. What do we got? We got the uh, four and five. Yeah, four and five. Let's go. Oop. Come on, tench. Got a happy hour right now. It's happy hour. Let's go. Now we're fishing. People always ask me, they say, Bo, when are you actually fishing? This is that moment. This is that moment. I am fishing now. Here I go. Watch me fish. Can we get anything with a spinner out here? Let's find out. Probably end up catching onto a pike or something like that and regretting it. Where have you been, bro? What do you mean where I've been? I've been talking about it for the last two weeks about going to Taiwan. Pretty much every live stream. Yeah, I mentioned it in videos. I'm gonna be gone in Taiwan. Doing stuff. This game looks good for my toaster laptop. You have a toaster and a laptop combined? It's freaking sweet. I have no idea how many times I've been playing on a computer and thought, you know what I could go for right now? Some freaking toast. Sounds delicioso. It's been buggy since Halloween event ended. The onion. The death onion. We ain't getting no bites. We ain't getting no bites. Would you rather Fishing Planet or Russian Fishing 4? Would I rather cake or ice cream? Hard to say, man. Some days I like cake, some days I like ice cream. No, I mean, no, I mean, if I'm at a birthday party, someone said cake or ice cream. I'm just grabbing whatever they give me. And then I'm going back and grabbing the other thing. They can't stop me. I'm having both. Just join. Why are you playing Russian fishing? Is there something I don't know? Uh, I guess so, because we tried playing fishing planet and it crashed three times. So we switch to a different game until they fix it. Just made PB&J. PB&J with toast? I don't think I've ever had a PB&J with toast. And PB&J is my favorite food. Now you're making me think differently about my entire life. My life choices up to this point. Where did I go wrong? Where I never tried PB&J on toast. <gasps> Nibbles, nibbles, everybody. Watch the dingles. Watch the dingles go dingle, dingle. Ooh. 
What a tease. Freaking teaser. Can't do that to us. I was going to say, this is when the other one starts to go. Go, bro. We are getting some mad jingles right now without a take. Some days it's good, some days it's bad. Just gotta pay your dues. Oh, I know. Will you play Fishing Planet again? Actually, during this live stream, I, rid it, I, I wrote it off for the rest of my life. I will never, ever play it again. Ever, 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 ever. So, uh, so sorry. Yeah, I realize you were just asking if we were going to play it again during the live stream. But no, we're never going to play it ever again. Ever. Ever. So, uh, that's the end. That's the end of it. Thanks for coming. I hope you enjoyed. Hope you enjoyed. I'm sick of the freaking dingles. Dingles with no bites. That's wrong. Like it when they uh when they hashtag bend over. You know what I mean? Watching that rod bend over. That's why I like rod. Set setting hooks. Hook hooking them. Fucking damn. All right, this is painful. I'm gonna switch, go to Balea River. Let's catch some browns and graylings and something else. Ever had a fried PBJ before? I can't say I have. Was it good? Either either fishing in real life. It is 8.15 at night, pitch black. Feel free to go fishing in real life if you want to. But it's gonna be dark and I'm gonna be going to bed in like an hour so it take me 20 minutes just to get out to the river and then 20 minutes to get back that means I'd get 20 minutes of real life fishing in and I'm sitting on my computer right now fishing away for browns so do what you want to do Coco name of a freaking fairy tale creature in a cartoon Camera just went out of focus for a moment there. Go! I wonder what number is going right now. Felipe is here. Since I've started watching the stream, I've been to every single one of them. Have you, British Animations? Whoa! A decent fish. Hooks up. Hooks up. Well, if you're just now getting to the stream, I just want you all to know that you've missed out on some pretty sweet videos I've showed off. So... Just want to throw that out there to make you upset. 500 gram. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Big cast. Big cast. I actually heard someone up the island say that, too. Wow, what a cast. I heard it. I got I got away. I got away with casting. People are often impressed. I know. I didn't know how it is. One more cast. One more cast by this rock. the videos 
Grow TNT. That's the easy way to get him. Grow that TNT. I didn't pack any, unfortunately. Classic noob move. Classic. There's a peanut butter ghost carp. I don't know. <laughs> you should do a beginner series, but like every level you add bait coins or every map you go to, you add bait coins. Why? Well, the whole point of a beginner series is that it's like relatable. You know, you can watch it and go, yeah, I'm in that exact same scenario. What good would it be if every time I go to a new map or gain a level or something, I buy a DLC? You know? It's like when you have these celebrities that are like, I'm just like you. I go to high school. I drive a Lamborghini. I wear Louis Vuitton slippers. I'm just like you. Don't you know? We are the same. Doesn't make sense. This doesn't make sense. Have a fishing tournament on Saturday the 11th? Well, yeah, man. Hopefully. That'd be awesome. If you had to only use one fishing lure bait for the rest of your life in real life, what would it be? I don't know. Hard to say. Hard to say, man. Oh, we got a fish. I didn't even see that. <laughs> I looked up at the uh, at the uh, animation, and we got a bite. I didn't even see. It's a pretty decent fish, honestly. Uh, doesn't look like a grayling at the moment. It's a chub. Oh man. I was thinking we got a pretty decent uh, brown on, but no. Dumb. Do you not have Louis Vuitton slippers? Psh. Of course, of course I do. Psh. Everybody's got Louis Vuitton slippers. I got them in the back of my Lambo. Do Lambos? They they probably don't even have a back. <laughs> That's where the engine is, isn't it? <laughs> I got them in the back where the engine is. Come on now. Am I thinking of old Lambos? I don't know how I don't know how Lambos are. Dude. I'm not a car guy. I just toss names out. Got the 500,000 for one fish? I don't think so. Wish the British weather was better. You know? I I can I I can I know I can understand that. Tomen are much better than largemouth bass. It's it's uh it's very true. They're uh they're a very fun fish. Fishing plants working okay for you? Look at that little chub at the end there. Jumped on at the end. Playing fishing game with your friend? Well, very cool. Ooh, ooh, good fish, good fish. Good fish. Oh, it's a grayling. Dude, he was pulling out line at the beginning there. I thought we had a really good fish on. He was pulling out line. And then it was a stinking grayling. Come here, you.
Yeah, that's a nice grayling though. Almost a KG. Look at that big old fin. That's sweet, man. 1868. 4,203 total XP. We're almost level 21. Let's see. We're using the Spiker 18. We could switch to the 16, though. Let's do it. Dare we? Dare we. Let's do it. What's your favorite lake on this game? You know, I haven't played enough of them. I, I, I really can't say at the moment. Red Dead Redemption 2 has fishing in it. I, I know, right? We switched lures and I think we got another grayling. Yeah, it's a smaller grayling. Russian fishing on mobile? It is not on mobile, but it is free. You don't have Louis Vuitton slippers? Oh. I'd rather not walk on my money. I'd rather not walk on my money. That's probably really difficult to do, eh? Pretty much anything you buy. You can't walk on your carpet in your house. You can't walk on shoes. Can't walk on slippers. Can't walk on the floors of the like floors of your car. If you bought some land, you couldn't walk on that either. That's crazy. How can you live your life without walking on your money? Maybe you're one of the people that are like no man possessions are like possessions aren't real no one really owns anything so you can't ever be walking on your money because money is a figment of your imagination man <laughs> this is an interesting fish it's putting up a good little fight he's actually like moving and stuff i wonder if this is our first brown See how much this bar at the bottom is moving? He's not though. What are you, an asp? He's putting up a little bit of a fight. I'm, I enjoyed him. I think it is a little asp. That was awesome, dude. For as small as he is, he really put up a little, a little bit of a fight. That was kind of fun. <laughs> he was moving back and forth and uh, the meter was moving. He was doing some head shakes. That was awesome. Got all sorts of stuff with this lure. I don't want to go back. The bushes are so thick. Thick and bushes. Enjoy my little Subaru. Save me from that deer. Heck. Save me from a deer. I, I'll. Yep. I'm a fan. I'm a fan. Too much grind in RF4. R4. Good trip. Great trip. Really enjoyed it. Had a great time. Let it sink. Let it sink. Just a little bit. Which game is easier? Russian Fishing 4 or Fishing Planet? I would say the fishing planet is arguably easier. Though they both can be a little bit difficult. Both games you're probably going to be looking up videos to help you out. Put it put it some way. When I reach level 50, should I stay fishing at Sturgeon in San Joaquin? I, 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 I wouldn't. But I don't know. Weeping willows does require a bit of uh, a bit of investment to make good 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 like work at I guess I'm not sure if that's the best way to put it but like you could you could end up fighting some fish for quite a while but who knows that to hear it's not on mo attaching a monitor to a potato would work better than my computer oh man. 
That doesn't sound good at all. Favorite lake on Fishing Planet? Hard to say, man. I like so many of them. I've uh, I uh, I tell people this all the time. I'm a I'm a fickle man. I uh, I get bored of things fairly quickly, so uh, it's hard to say favorite of anything because I I get bored of just about anything fairly quickly, and then move on to something else. So it's hard for me to choose a favorite of anything. They have a jetpack. <gasps> jetpack. I'm a high school kid just like you. I drive a Lamborghini. I've got a jetpack. I have a cat. And I wear Louis Vuitton slippers. Classic. A classic. Are they going to give me any money for these fish? Yeah, they are. Look at the money they're going to give me for these stinking fish. They're so old. They're from September. <laughs> These fish are from September. They probably smell so bad. <laughs> My guy's just been carrying them in his knapsack like nothing's happening. <laughs> Dude, that one grayling's worth $9. Holy crap. That was a good grayling. This place going to take it for more? No, unfortunately. Take my money. Yeah, boy. That one grayling made up. We sold all that for 14 bucks, but that one grayling was nine. Nine dollars out of 14. I think a lot of people like, uh, they have the rocks on either end of this island. And so they don't really just try casting onto this open water too often, but actually done pretty well just casting out into the open water does fairly well you'll still catch fish out there who's walking on the floor of their car I don't know I don't know is it only walking oh <gasps> it's chub it's a stinking chub again Can you be crouched sitting? Huh? Can you be sitting and walking at the same time? I don't know. Uh, what if you have a camper van? Aha! Then you would be walking on the floor of your car. Got it. There's always something. Always, always. Yeah, elementary. Elementary, my dear Watson. Camper van, obviously. <laughs> 2 30 a.m. in the UK. Oh, you better go, man. Find Pike more fun than Sturgeon Farm, but also want to catch Sturgeon. I get it. There was a number of times I switched back and forth just for uh, just for keeping keeping it fun. You know what I mean? Want to keep it fun? Oh yeah, selling that fish for fertilizer. Went fishing and caught a one-pound bass. Felipe says, "Very nice, dude. You have fun." There's a fish. There's a fish. Bro, we are yet to catch a brown out of here. Yet to catch a brown out of here. Poor Hino. It's probably super icky. He probably is. Poor guy. All super icky looking. Just depends on what you feel like catching that day. It's exactly right. It's 
size difference can make up for the fight since you fill your net faster. That, 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 that's right. Speaking truth, there's truth speakers tonight, ladies and gents. People be speaking the truth. Headed off now. I'm really tired. Hope to come next stream. Sounds good. I would love to say that I'm heading to bed. I'm rather tired as well. But I'm not. Fishing. Where's Fishing Planet? Yeah, good question. Where is Fishing Planet? Because every time we tried playing tonight, the game crashed. Dude, this is a nice brown trout. Let's go! 650 G! 650 G Brown, man! Let's go! Look at this guy! He looks happy to see us. He's smiling. Not really, but, you know. 6,264 total XP. Ka-ching! Ka-ching! Let's go! First Brown Trout, and he was a keeper. What a stud. What a stud. <sighs> what game is this? This is uh, Russian Fishing 4. Whoa, another one. Another decent little fish. Stand, it's a grayling. It's a stinking grayling. I feel like catching these Oreos. <laughs> Got him. Get in my belly, Oreos. 719. 719. Big cast, big cast. We are. Um, we are at the point in uh, Russian Fishing 4 where, like, we're going to be starting to buy some good stuff and then heading off to another lake to catch some larger fish here soon, which I'm looking forward to because we've been doing. The fishing in Belay River for brown trout and grayling for quite a while. And uh, don't tell anyone, but I'm kind of getting bored of it. So uh, yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to moving on. Little tiny baby. Little tiny baby brown. We don't even have to move. Just fish after fish in this one spot. Is, isn't Fishing Planet? Where's the Fishing Planet? Hey, how many times do I have to say this? We started playing Fishing Planet and the game crashed so many times we finally switched to another game. Now, you have to tell everyone else who comes and says something about it because I'm sick of repeating myself. Yeah, so they changed the perch model in the game and it is pretty cool. I like it. Little glittery up top here. It's cool. <laughs> yep. I like that. Oh, that's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Servers went down. It's working now. Yeah, that's what that's what they said after the second time it crashed. That's what they said after the second time it crashed. We spotted out a good 15 spots of stuff, and then we're just about ready to uh, to get back into fishing, and the game crashed again. So we quit. Whoa! Big fish! Big fish! Dude, look at the line he's taking. Big fish! Just keep setting the hook because I want to make sure. Dude! Taking line for days! No! Stay on! Okay, last time we had a fish like this, we lost it. And I don't want that to happen. The 
Going down the river. <gasps> Don't you even. We're hooked up. We're hooked up on them. We got good hooks. I'm gonna slowly start making our way towards him. this for a second there. Okay. Making some headway on him. Yeah, we got him, bro. Dude, big brown. Big brown, man. Let's go. Get in here, big brown. Dude, let's go. Let's go. Boo! One, almost 1.5 kgs. 14,000 total XP. That is wild. Let's go. That's like three, three pound, three pound brown right there. Three pound brown, three pound brown. Anyone guess that? Anyone guess that weight? Ever tried call the wild angler? Ever tried searching for it on our channel? Bruh, we were one of the first people to play that game. You've hidden them on, you've hidden your Oreos on the side of the bed. Oh my God. Pretty fish. Glad we got a good one. I'm happy. I'm content. Time to go to bed. Just kidding. Keeping him, keeping him and moving on. I'm glad we finally got into the Browns. I was, uh, I enjoy the grayling and whatnot. That's fun. I mean, it's, it's fun. It's, it's nice to catch a fish. Don't get me wrong. But the Browns at Belay, that's uh, that's what's uh, that's what's good. A fishing plan after hooking fish lag. Fish no longer hook multiple times. <gasps> no, Socrates, no. This why, this why we're staying. Pro fishing junior is back. Good deal. He's back, back again. Fishing Junior's back, tell a friend. Monster fish. How was your trip? My trip was well. It went well. Uh, we did some awesome things. I'm excited to put some videos together for all of you to see. Um, but yeah. It was a good time. I enjoyed it. Really enjoyed it. Should I try to get back into Fishing Planet? Been playing COD lately. You know, you just do what you want to do, man. If you like COD so much, uh, I think they have COD in, uh, in Russian Fishing 4, but not in Fishing Planet yet. Right on! We just hit level 21. That's sweet. Boom shakalaka with this little tiny grayling. We hit level 21. How many points do we have? Do we have any points to spend? Doesn't look like it, does it? Oh, we do. We have eight. We have eight points we can spend. Holy schmoly. We could put we could put points into fishing with a wobbler, fishing using a bait casting reel. Oh, oh. Fishing with a spoon, fishing with spinning rod, jigging. We can put points into so many things right now. Or we could go into, um, yeah, harvesting baits, cooking, 
making ground bait, making lures, marine fishing. Just kidding. Probably not gonna get into marine fishing. Anywho, fun to see though. We do have a uh, we do have a lot of options that we could do. So good to see. Good to see. I will probably end up putting points into spinning. What I want to put them into in spinning, I don't know yet. But eventually, eventually, fishing with a wobbler is that um. Is that what they call like a crankbait? What is a freaking wobbler? When's the next video coming out? I don't know. When is it coming out? Please tell me. What if he cuddles up just for Oreos? Ah, that's a, that's a, that's a good way to go about it. Let's see here. Lures, wobblers. Let's find out. Yeah. Like little crankbaits and stuff. So we can use wobblers now, huh? Yeah, we can. Yeah, we can use wobblers. Gonna be wobbling like a freaking fiend, bro. Well, that's pretty cool. Look at all these wobblers we can use. Depth four meters. That one goes pretty deep there, man. That'll come in handy when we're wanting to like fish at uh, Quarry Lake. We're wanting to fish Quarry Lake, like on the lake and doing some like uh, trolling and whatnot. That'd be sick, dude. Yeah, we'll have to, uh, we'll eventually buy some reels and stuff. I have listed here the rods and reels that we need to buy. So we'll do that at one, at, at some point. That way we can go to Quarry Lake and, uh, and troll, do some trolling for the, the fish there and hopefully be able to catch them just fine find out I get why do you cast and immediately start reeling in I just do whatever I need to do to catch fish and so far we are catching fish really well in fact wonder uh, I don't think the cafe was asking for brown trout but if not we might see how much that one brown trout was worth because it was a big one. and I like big and browns like that no, I want a perch, but we definitely did not catch a perch that big. Definitely didn't catch a chub that big either. How much do they want for that big old brown trout? Twenty dollars? You better believe it. Take that twenty dollars and run. Twenty-eight dollars for this other brown. Thirty-seven for everything? Yes, please. We're making monies. Let's go. What game is this? What game do you think it is? We play like three games. But at any given time, we like switch between three different games. Is it really that hard to, to guess between three games what we're playing? Goodness gracious. This is Russian fishing for just to cut the, the the questioning out. I know you are going into like a Sherlock Holmes sort of like, what game is he playing? I'm going to do some investigative research, but uh, I'll cut to the chase. Dude, another brown. Are you joking me? We have gotten to the school of browns and I'm loving it. Ba 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 ba. I'm loving the browns. Get out here. Dude, putting in a little bit of a fight towards the end there. I like that. Kind of creepy putting it that way. Putting up a bit of fight towards the end there. I like that. Keep that fight up. I like that a lot. Sounds kind of creepy when you put it that way. Just as long as you don't ask them to squeal. Dude, are you serious? Oh, it's a grayling. It's still going to be a good size grayling. That last grayling that was big was like eight pounds or uh, eight dollars. They give us eight dollars for that grayling. 
I'm curious what they're going to give us for this one. Dude, look at this grayling. Let's go! Absolutely! 889. I feel like the last big grayling we caught was also 889. Maybe not. I don't know. How much does this game cost? It's free! Free to play. Only on PC, but it's free to play. This is an RPG? It is an RPG. It's a fishing RPG. <laughs> I'd lose a finger going for them Oreos. <laughs> The UI reminds you of Microsoft Store and Windows 8. Yeah, it don't look. It doesn't look amazing. Another little perch. Catching more perch out here than I remember. Did they? Is that something they changed? I don't remember catching so many perch out here. Beziab loves the brown. Loves loves that brown. That list of new rods and reels never goes away. No, I just keep it on my desk. I just stare at it. Too intimidated to actually buy anything. I just I just stare at it and go, someday, someday I'll buy them rods and reels. Another good size grayling. This is smaller, but still, 645. Ain't bad. Catching fish after fish. We don't even have to move. The money buildup is really slow, but fishing plants money gain is unrealistic. Boy, you just can't win, can you? The graylings are really pretty, not gonna lie. I agree, man. That big old red fin is really cool. One more cast without a fish, and then we'll go check prices and move. Let's go. Check in those prices. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tent. Tent is empty. $10 for that brown and $10 for the grayling. Holy schmoly, 25. Hey, we're making bank here today. We are making so much money. Hi, how's it going, Hayden? Boom, 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 boom. Birthday cake. I've had this birthday cake for so long and it's still good. Nuclear birthday cake. It lasts forever. I'll be honest with you guys. I'm tired. This live stream has not gone how it's supposed to go. No one seems to be having fun. So we might end it at nine o'clock. It'll be our baby steps to getting back into the thick of it. It's dropping like crazy. All I could figure out to do was hang out in the cabin. Is there some trick to keeping comfort up? I don't know. 
Really, I don't I don't know if it really matters that much though, to be honest. Yeah, I, 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 I'm sure that there is some sort of like uh, there's uh, there's obviously some sort of reasoning behind the comfort and stuff like that, but I've never noticed it really mattering all that much. Wouldn't a nuclear birthday cake have a sh really short self life? I don't know. I was thinking of like Fallout and how like there's a lot of those foods that last forever, it seems, because you're still eating them in the grocery stores and stuff like that. It was more of a figurative Fallout than uh, like a figurative nuclear cake versus not like it like an actual 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 sort of thing coco's back you're back for the ending the last six minutes get you some rest oh yeah well thank you hey there we go oh no we lost them He was on and then he was off. Russian fishing, have you been attacked by a bear or a sea monster? I have not. I have not experienced either. There's only one map that has a bear on it though. As far as I'm aware, I don't even have it yet. Can you catch the sea monster? Hope to catch another stream soon. Absolutely, Socrates. Can we try to catch one of those tension in the last five minutes? Let's do it. Back to Old Berg. Let's go. They evaded us. They evaded us the first time we were here. Let's see if we can get them this second time. Let's go. Running through the woods, but do 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 do. Running through the woods. What are you using for your spinners? I was using uh, the Z-Man Spiker, number two, 16. We have a 16, the 18, 10, 2, 18. Yeah, we got all sorts of stuff. Lots of 18s. But we got a lot of the Z-Man Spikers. They seem to work pretty well from what we can tell. Did they tell you what the biggest size range you can catch in the ocean map? No, they did not tell me. I don't know the, the size of a range that you can catch. We looked up how big the uh, 
<sighs> world record size like marlin was and it was like over a thousand some odd pounds so i'm not sure It'll be interesting to see two more minutes two minutes to catch a tench get some rest from fishing planet One more minute. Come on, Tench. Liven up now. 1,402 pounds to be exact. There you go. That's exactly how heavy the blue marlin in the game is going to be. I'm sure of it. Stubborn tent. I know, man. Gal, girl. Jeez. Like how I'm just like this little fraction of the uh, the window that I'm in right now. What bait are we using? I think we're using like oats or something like that. Barley. We're using barley. Barley. It used to be what the tench always went for. It don't bother me. <laughs> You call everyone man and dude. <laughs> Understandable. If I know anything, it's that every everyone's everyone's a man. So, some some are are woe mans, and then others are just mans, you know, or or a fraction of of thereof, or something like that. Whether you're a wool man or a man, you're still a man. Man. You know, you know what I mean, man? Dude. Big truth, big truth. Alright everyone, well the truth the uh, truth is the tents are being stubborn. But we haven't caught one all stream, even if we got some jingle jangles at one point. But anyway, it's good to be back. I'm sorry I couldn't hang on for it, but I'm very tired, and I'm ready to go lay in bed. And uh, fishing plan didn't work out for us, so I think, you know, we're just going to make the most of uh, what we got, and that is ending it today. Except the animals. Except the animals. There you go. All right. We'll take care. We'll see you next time. And as always, remember, everybody... Love these little crickets at the end. That's what we really need to set set the loneliness of this stream out. <laughs>